Hello YouTube and welcome to this Groundworks KSP tutorial. Today I will be showing you how to install a scatterer mod for the KSP. I mean the same rules apply as for any mods. So here over on the left hand side you have your regular Kerbal Space Program data folder. So uh, a typical place where you would find this is in your Steam library steam apps common kerbal space program and then inside you want to be taking a look at the game data folder okay i'm going to leave that highlighted just now also you want to go head over to the website spacedoc.info and her here under search mods you want to go for search for scatterer okay and and press search. So as you can see the results for scatter are right here but it says that it's for 130. Uh, I'm running with KSP 131 but it doesn't matter I mean you can always give it a try if it works it works. As you can see here game version 130. Okay so you download the file and then you will be prompted to basically save the file which you do or alternatively you open it up. Then we want to go over to our download file where you have downloaded this file. You double click it, you open it and notice that inside inside you have also a game data folder. Now this is where some people get it wrong. Some might copy over, some might copy. So the key point what I try to do to avoid mistakes is to enter the game data folder of the KSP so that I can see here inside squad. This would be basically where all of my mods will be listed. Then I head over to the zip, I double click it and here inside everything that's underneath this game data folder, so everything underneath it, which is in this case scatter, needs to go in the game data folder of the game itself. So, oops, uh, you just drag it over and there you should see scatter. So, now let's just run KSP and take a look how it looks. So when you do it, then what you should be seeing is this screen when you boot up. This is the scatterer window telling you that the scatterer is working and operational. So in that case, that would mean that you had a successful install. And as you can see, I'm running 131. So if we come here and then observe, uh, the scattering effects already look okay. If you go to the page, Anyway, when you launch, you should be like seeing scattering effects both on the tracking station. Yes, that's the word. Tracking station and also in your game. Uh, don't be alarmed if you don't see the scatter effects on your loading screen because I don't think it shows any longer on the loading screen. And as you can see here, we have wonderful atmospheric scattering effects and everything is working pretty much as expected. So once again, you download the file from the spacedoc.info. I'm going to be posting the link in the description below. And then you just copy the contents of the game data folder in the zip file over to the game data folder where your KSP is installed. And that's how you install Scatter and any other mod for that matter into the KSP. Well, I hope that you like this tutorial. I will any like or subscribe would be deeply appreciated so please do let me know what you think and i'll see be seeing you all in my next video but until then thank you very much for watching this is groundworks signing off